Today I'm going to show you how to put in a wood insert nut. I've used these things for years. I've fought them for years. They drive me nuts, pun intended. And today, after some frustration, I finally found an answer I think you're going to dig. This shows one of them in place. Nice positioning. You like that? Things are looking good. I'll show you how I did it. Here's what they look like. They're brass. They have a slot in here. Look, you can put a screwdriver in it. You can turn that and it'll go in there just fine. Other than the fact that brass is soft and it breaks right here at these corners where you're putting the where you're applying the pressure. It twists it off. And then you've got a boogered up piece of brass stuck in your your material, you're screwed. So what I've so what I've done is I took an extra a, a nut. Here's my here's my bolt. I took a nut, I bought a nut, spent an extra 12 cents, and I put it here. Then I screwed my insert nut onto it. Notice that the nut doesn't go all the way to the bottom. Now, I can take this using my driver of choice. I can screw that in. I've got a full cylinder protection for that insert nut to go to where it needs to go. It will not come up, slide up because that nut is blocking it. Then when the time comes and that gets tight, because it'll go down all the way flush, just exactly like you want it to on your on your workpiece, because it stops at this nut. You take a wrench, you loosen this nut. Your your uh, your workpiece will come through. You can pull it out, take that extra nut off, and you're going to end up with that. A perfectly inserted wood insert nut for you to put onto your uh, workpiece uh, with no boogered up threads. Yeah, sorry it took me so long to figure that out.